We've got Lewandowski coming up first for Bayern Munich. Lewandowski against Gulashi. Step one of ten, and then we'll know probably who is in the next cup round. Lewandowski against Gulashi. Oh, Lewandowski scores. Gulashi was in the right corner, though. Still, Lewandowski makes it, let's just say, 1 0 here. And penalties will add it all up together later. And I think it's Bernardo who takes the first penalty for Leipzig. 22 year old Brazilian right back. Let's see if he can produce against Sven Ulreich. Bernardo. Yep. 1 1 in penalties. Takes the shot to the left. Ulreich dives down to the right. Well, I say Ulreich dives down to the right. Uh, he does, but Bernardo, not a really very good penalty at all. Alaba up next for Bayern Munich. Usually a very good uh, penalty taker. Hasan Salihamidzic closing his eyes. It seems as if he's praying to uh, whatever good spirits he can pray to. And Alaba scores beautifully. Second goal for Bayern in this penalty shootout. against Ulreich, Campbell, oh dear, looks a bit nervous to me, Campbell against Ulreich, Kevin Campbell scores as well, Ulreich in the wrong corner again. So far, all the penalties taken quite nicely, and Bayern are up again with Mats Hummels this time. Jo Pinker says he's got it all. Let's see if he's got penalties today. Hummus, usually safe penalty taker, of course, Mats. Hummus! Oh, beautiful penalty. High up into the corner, no chance whatsoever for Gulashi. And this is the advantage that Bayern have that they're using right now. Oh, what a penalty there by Hummus, my God. Right into the top hand corner. From his point of view, uh, the left. No chance whatsoever. For Gulashi. And now it's Marcel Halstenberg. See a couple of Leipzig fans praying Halstenberg against Ulreich. Halstenberg scores. And that was right back into the center as well. Wow. Ulreich. And he had a couple of opportunities here to save. I'd say overall the Bayern penalties are taken better than the Leipzig penalties. Rudi. Now, this is a guy who has a better passing and shooting technique than most players on this planet. He should always score from penalties, but of course it's not that easy. Rudy scores! Good shot, again. Gulashi in the right corner, and that's what's causing me a little bit of concern here. Ulreich basically in the wrong corner every single time, while Gulashi's in the right corner every time, but misses them. Willi Orban comes up now, Leipzig captain. He's a safe penalty taker usually too. Some Willy Orban chants from the fans now. Willy Orban against Sven Ulreich. Orban against Ulreich. Oh, it's in the center again, low in the center. Wow. That's a really, really weak penalty. And yeah, that's a shame that Ulreich hasn't saved one of those. Arian Robin coming up last. Penalty taker for Bayern of the five. And then we're going to go into overtime here as well. Arian Robin against Peter Gulashi. Arian Robin scores beautifully. Just a nice, precise ball to the corner, and Gulashi's in the right corner again. That is a wonderful penalty by Robin, but dear Lord, Gulashi is doing a good job here. He's in the right corner, and I think four out of five times where Ulreich is. Nowhere near it. Timo Werner. What's Ulreich going to do now? Three times he's jumped into a corner and the Leipzig players just took it into the center. Timo Werner against Ulreich. Werner is denied by Ulreich. Timo Werner misses and Ulreich saves. Ulreich saves and Werner is the man who loses as Bayern Munich progress to the next DFB Cup round. Ulreich flies all over the place, just nowhere near a ball, and then he's the man who saves it anyway, whereas Peter Gulashi is in the right corner in every single shot, but just can't prevent these very well-taken penalties by Bayern from crossing the line, and Bayern are through.